Hi, it's Alaska Granny. Do you have these little P38 can openers? They were created by the military back during World War II and were dropped in with meals to the troops uh, so they could open things like C rations and K rations. And so you, when you look for them, they're a handy little gadget. They're super flat. If you've ever been in Boy Scouts, you may have received one from your Scoutmaster. There's a little hole in it. You could even hook it to your keychain, or some of the military guys even used to hang them onto their dog tags as that was that important to them. So it's fine to find these, but then you have to learn how to use them. So what you do is you fold this blade out, and then you go to the rim of your can, and you puncture it. And for me, that's the hardest part, is getting it punctured. There you go. Did you hear it? Then you go around the can, pushing on it like this, and you work the opener around the can. And the reason they called it P38 was they figured it took 38 uh, punctures to get around the cans that they would open. So you can see this works. It's not as easy as you'd think. So get some of these and then try using them a few times so you're familiar with them. I have lots of them whenever I see them at things like gun shows. I buy several of them because I put them in places like my bug out bag, I have them in my car, I have them in camping gear, I have them in hunting bags, and I want to have them all over the place because if you've got lots of canned goods that you're saving up, <laughs> they're not going to do you any good if you can't get them open. Okay, so you can see how it works, and I'm not going to make you watch me go round and round with my little weak hands. The other thing that I do is if you buy these number can, 10 cans of food, I put them under the lids on some of these so that I'll have extras should I be stranded somewhere and all I did was remember to grab a big old can of something, I can still open it. Anyway, look for these P38s. Try to find ones that are made in the United States so that they're actually going to last. And uh, grab a bunch of them and keep them with all of your gear and practice using them. Leave me a tip on how you might use these. And if you would like to continue to receive videos with tips and tricks from Alaska Granny, please subscribe to my channel. Have a wonderful day.